What's up, Dark Sizzle Nation? Today's video is a story about our first fishing trip of the brand new year and also showing you that you have to try different methods and techniques while you're out fishing. Never give up. And that's exactly what we did and you will catch fish just like we did. So check out this incredible day of fishing. Good morning, Dark Sizzle Nation. If you're new to the channel, my name is Dark Sizzle and that's Brian, my boyfriend behind me. It's just the two of us today. We're offshore deep sea fishing. Brian is getting the lines out and I am being the captain at the moment and driving the boat, keeping us straight while he sends those lines out. We're gonna start trolling here. It's officially 2018. Today is January 1st. You're seeing this after the first of the year, but happy new year to all of you guys. I hope you have a healthy and prosperous year and hopefully we're gonna get on some fish. Today is also a full moon, which means that's not necessarily a good thing for the fishing today. But if you guys have been watching, you know the last full moon, we actually had a weird catch and we got an awesome red grouper. So you just really don't know. You have to come out here, you have to put your time in, get lines out, and you could catch a fish. So I'm just staying optimistic. Fish on, first fish of the brand new year. And we've been trolling now for a couple hours. We haven't got a bite yet. And I was get losing hope there for a little bit. There's been a lot of blackfin around. This could actually be a blackfin. I'd be excited. It's probably Benita, but we'll see. Through the tuna door. <laughs> the tuna door opening up. I can't even open it. It's not big enough. Oh. Giant fish. First fish of 2018 on the Dar Sizzle Offshore Pro Line. And I think we only got room to grow. I can't imagine if I catch another small fish like this, but we'll see. Uh, so beautiful little bonita, also known as a little tunny, and this is great bait. Did you just make that up? It's a, <laughs> it's a little tunny. Also known as a little tunny. No, I've heard L it called boat. A, a little tunny? I'm saying tunny. <laughs> it's a little tuna. So it's, we call it bonita here, but you guys call it's it a little not tuny. A tuna. It's a bonita. Yes. A false albacore. Little toony, they call it. Tony. We call it a bonita here, but I know some of you guys won't like that. This is my birthday fish. I'm gonna reel. I get the reel in one fish for my birthday, which is two days ago. It's oh, a... Carl, thanks to the sharpening stones, I actually used them to sharpen hooks for today's trip. So thanks. Give me your yeah. Catching some good bait today. This one's a little bigger than Darcy, so I am winning. I don't like to catch bonita, but at the same time, I'm happy to see the bonita in the area, especially like the smaller size one that I caught first because that means that if there is wahoo here and they're biting, they're feeding on them. So as long as we're catching Bonita and we're staying in that zone, that's a good sign. So let's cross my fingers. Ooh, he dumped a lot of lime. It's a Bonita. They're getting bigger, getting bigger. Ballyhood squid chain which is hooked right here, but this is what been, has been catching all the fish today. That was a short bite. Woo! Take in line, take in line. It's getting bigger still. Jeez. That was really cool. Check out this Benita. He just did a short strike. He hit one of our shortest lures really close to the boat. Actually, it's hanging right here in his mouth. One of the smallest we're pulling as well, which is a blue and white um, trolling lure, as you can see right here. And this bonita is still bigger than all the rest, so we're just getting bigger bonita as the day goes on. But hey, we're catching fish on New Year's Day. She's the one I'm thinking of. Hey, the only one I'm thinking of. Hey, she's everything I'm dreaming of. Hey, the one that I can live with. to switch it up guys we are now inshore fishing and i just put out a lure and i'm hooked up on a fish now with the full moon out there today it's just tough really tough fishing so all we caught was bonitas for the new year so far but whatever we caught fish i'm happy and plus there was a south current which is a big no-no lots of these little guys around lately fish on all right i don't have all my spinning gear setups today for snook so I ended up using my Max L reel here to troll one of my Zuri Crystal Minnow lures. And it just hooked a fish. He's running to the boat. Oh my goodness, guys. I just hooked our first fish, our first snook of the day. Woohoo! Awesome. I'm going to get him off these hooks real quick, release him, let him grow big again, 
But this is the lure that I love. This is the Azuri 3DB Minnow, and I'll link it down in the description below for you guys. But I'm trying out a new color today, and as you can see, it's working. I'm gonna release this beautiful little snook. I just want to get a quick measure on him, just because I'm curious. He's 19 inches long. But these guys, it's currently not season for them. They're delicious to eat. Please release you, buddy. There he goes. Look, he's just chilling by the boat. <laughs> awesome. That's exactly what I want to see. He doesn't want to leave us. But the snook, basically they're delicious to eat. They have to be in a certain slot size, which means a minimum and a maximum. They have to be a minimum of 28 inches long to 32 inches long. And if they're within that, that slot size, it's a keeper. But right now, these fish are not keepers. It's illegal to keep any snook currently. And I believe season opens back up, uh, doesn't open until March 31st, 2018. Oh my God. Snook, snook, slow down. We got small snookies today, guys. Once again, the same lure. He's catching snook, baby. Woo, a little bigger. He's a little bigger. He's getting there. Using my bubble blade pliers. I'm just gonna get the barbs off, off of him real quick and show them to you guys. All right, check him out. Second snook of the day. He's a little bigger, but it seems like it's a small fish day. And once again, another new fish 2018. I'll take it. I'm happy with any snook. And I love seeing these guys so beautiful and he's gonna grow up to be a monster one day. Oh my god. He didn't take no drag, this thing's locked down. We got a snook. Oh baby. We're getting a little bigger, okay. <laughs> you look big. Slaying snooks today. The fish are getting bigger and bigger every time we get a species. It's great. Okay. Beautiful. Come on, relax. Beautiful, beautiful snook. He's probably like a 24 inch. I'll go ahead and measure him on my sea deck ruler for you guys. Here we go. But the cool thing about snook is that they all are born males. And then once they reach, here we go. This guy is just about 23 inches long. Cool. So he's beautiful, but snook end up getting, they're transgender, they're all born males. And then when they go through the puberty or sex change, half of them turn to females. And the females are the ones that get monstrous, 30 plus pounds, over 40 inches long. So this is a beautiful male snook and I'm gonna release him. But I'm just gonna stick him in the water face first and kind of just let him go right now. Here we go. Hi buddy, see you later. He's just chilling again, right by the boat. I guess these snook are happy today, but today I think ended up being an epic day for us. Offshore and inshore, we caught a bunch of bonitas, and the bonitas just kept getting bigger. And then inshore, we caught a bunch of snook, and the snook just kept getting bigger. So I think it's a great way to start 2018. Woohoo! Detour, check one of my traps, my crab traps. Got it! Oh no. Darcy, you're Ryan, right into stuck. it. Let me go then. All right, all right. Let me go. Well, now we're crazy. Well, that, that's a little bit of a mess. <laughs> that was not good. Yeah, that was a mess, and the thing got wrapped around the side of the piling there. That was not good. So, I'm not too optimistic. We'll see what happens. Oh my god, we got the mother load. We got a mother load of freaking stone crabs. I'm gonna do a dance right now because this is like the bonus of the day, baby. Let's let's see that dance. <laughs> what is the dance? No, they ate. They were dance. They're eating my club. They're eating each other. All right, I don't have. I got guys. This white girl can't dance, so just heads up. But my dance is like a little hopping around. Like Brian's a better dancer than I am. If you don't want to see that. Oh my gosh! He's the official winner. There's four in here. There's one dead that they've killed already. Look at, look at, look at this, look at this guy. Look at that claw. Show me your claws, guys, show me. Look at this brute. Ooh, I better let go of that little fish. Dude, look at this freaking crab. Look at this freaking claw. Oh my God, I can't even hold it. Oh my God. It's just incredible how powerful these stone crabs are. This is an absolute giant. I don't think this claw has ever been broken off. You can just see how like muscular and powerful it is and just insane crab right here. I think this is probably like the biggest that claws get. I think, I don't even know. 
Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Let's look at him moving! He's so powerful! Like, I'm not even joking! The Manalapan police just stopped by on a cute little boat and he wanted to say hello and said that his son watches our YouTube videos. So I'm not exactly sure what that cop's name is or who, you, who the son is, but I know, you, I'm sure you know who you are who lives on Manalapan. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching and uh, it was cool that your dad came by to say hello and just checking the traps and asking how we do it. So we're doing great. All right. Got my claw. Gonna release this guy with his claw here as well. This is, is a keeper claw but he gets to live another day and get his claw a little bigger for us. And but that was epic. I scored some jumbo claws. I'm stoked. And there's a little guy in here I'm gonna release. Oh, I just put it right in the middle. <laughs> Oops. Oops. Crashing. Whoa, with the rod. All right, that's how my rope gets wrapped. And I just, th that was my fault right there. But we know where it is. We'll come back. What an epic day to start off 2018 with the bonus of the crabs. That was awesome. Another record was set today. So uh, we're just having a blast out here, guys, and I can't wait to see what adventures hold for us in 2018. Hopefully you guys continue to follow us along on our adventures. We appreciate you. As always, make sure you subscribe, hit that bell notification, all that great stuff, and we'll be back with another adventure really soon. So until then, follow your dream and keep on catching. She's the one I'm thinking of, hey The only one I'm thinking of, hey She's everything I'm dreaming of, hey. Go! This guy is gonna fly out. Get them, Pat!